How's it going everyone? Welcome back to Forza Horizon 5. We are six updates into Horizon 5 right now because we're in Series 6, which means there's plenty more to go. We've got Series 7 next month, we've got Series 8 and the month after that. And in this video, we're going to be deep diving into what potentially the next series topics could be about. If you do enjoy this video, guys, please do consider subscribing to the channel. It helps out massively. Let's get into it. Now, as you know, every series in Horizon 5 has some kind of topic and the next series that we've not really had announced yet is going to be the Cinco de Mayo. Cinco de Mayo is a yearly celebration thing in Mexico that the next update is going to be based on and knowing this we can have a look at what other yearly celebration things happen within Mexico and what month they happen in and see if we can predict what some of the future series topics are going to be about. There are a few other yearly celebration things and it'll be quite interesting to, you know, make some predictions. We know that Series 1 of Horizon 5 was November, that was the first month it was released, nothing special there. Series 2 was December, this was the Christmas celebration month, um, you know, with Secret Santa and stuff like that. Series 3 was January, this was the New Year's Eve sort of celebration month. Series 4 was February, this was the World Cup series month. Series 5 was March, this was the Horizon Rush Takeover Stunt Park month. Series 6 is this month, which is Horizon Creatives, or Horizon Customs also known as. Series 7, which is in May, next month, is going to be the Cinco de Mayo sort of celebration series thing. Which brings us to Series 8 in June, Series 9 in July, all the way up to Series 15 next January. What do we think that these next series are going to be about? Well, what we can do is we can have a look at other Mexican sort of yearly celebration things, just like Cinco de Mayo next month. Are there any other major events happening in Mexico this year? Well, yes, there are. If you Google sort of yearly Mexico events and Mexican celebrations, you'll see there are quite a few things. We can see that the Cinco de Mayo is listed there, which is exactly what the next update is about. We can see that in June, which is the month after May, there is a National, Mar I don't know how to pronounce that, Man National Maritime Day. Doesn't seem like it will be major enough for Horizon 5 to have an update about it. Uh, the ones that stand out to me are in September and November. In September, there is the basically the Mexican Independence Day, which is quite a big thing in certain countries. So maybe it's a possibility that in September, which I believe will be Series 11 for Horizon 5, might be an Independence Day sort of themed update or themed series, just like next month. Is for Cinco de Mayo. And then the second one which stands out is the one in November, which is do known as the Day of the Dead or Dia de Muertos. Now I don't know how they do a series update about this in Horizon 5, but that's the only sort of other major event there are. All the other ones don't seem major enough. So looking at the events that are happening in Mexico this year, the only one that's certainly possible to me is possibly the Independence Day in September which sort of leaves us with June, July, August, October, November, December, all of them months could, could be anything, but we can still make pretty good guesses. June, July and August are known as the holiday time in some certain countries when everyone's off school, it's summer, it's sort of a holiday type time, maybe there'll be a holiday themed update within June, July or August. October, as we know, is Halloween. October will be series 12. Maybe October will be a Halloween themed update. I certainly think that that is a big possibility. The next month after that, which will be series 13, is November, which it will be one year exactly from the game's release. Maybe November will be a yearly anniversary thing, you know, sort of celebrating the one year release of Horizon 5. We'll have sort of an anniversary themed update for Series 13. That is also the same month as the Day of the Dead sort of celebration thing in Mexico, so I don't know how that would line up exactly. Series 14, which is December, takes us back into the loop of, you know, Series 14 is probably back to being a Christmas celebration, and January is probably another yearly New Year's Eve celebration as well. But what I'm curious about is all of the leftover months in between. There are no major things happening in Mexico in July, in June, or in August, in October, or in November. The themes for the updates really do open up, and they could be absolutely anything, really. We are certainly expecting the first expansion this year. We've sort of stopped talking about the first expansion on this channel because we've sort of just not heard anything about it, but 
I would, I'm willing to bet that whenever this first expansion is going to come out, I would say that the, the update, the series of that month will be focused towards the expansion. So at some point within the next you know year, one of the months will be taken over by the first expansion's release and the series will be sort of celebrating that. Most of the series so far have been based on a yearly event like Christmas, New Year, Cinco de Mayo. We've had the World Cup, the Stunt Park and the Horizon Creatives and those are nothing to do with real world events. Those are playground games made events and topics and that is what I think we're going to get more of over the next few months. Series which aren't about real world events and celebrations but more so what playground games pick to have the topic that month. A tuners update. We all want a, some kind of tuners or customization sort of themed update within Horizon 5 at some point. We want that to be the topic of the series. And we have series eight in June, we have series nine in July, we've got series 10 in August. There's nothing exciting happening in the real world at all in those months. Maybe we'll be getting a tuners update in one of those. You know, this is just a theory, no evidence backing this at all, just predictions. We've had the Horizon Rush takeover, the stunt park, as I said, which included tons more PR stunts. Maybe we'll get something similar to do with races. We will get a series that is all based on races, whether that's street races, rose races, dirt races or rally races, we'll just get one that's focused solely on that and we'll get tons more added around the map. They're already regularly adding Horizon stories to the game so I can't imagine we will get a uh, theme just about Horizon stories. I mean technically we did get one last month so that's already been ticked as well. So we've had PR stunts, we've had Horizon stories, we've not had new races yet. It's also very safe to bet that there are quite a few big features coming to the game as well. Back in Horizon 4 we had Super 7, that was an entire brand new feature added to the game. We had the Eliminator, that was an entire brand new feature added to the game. We had a Horizon promo returning as well. I can imagine there are a few big features and game modes similar to the Eliminator in Super 7 being worked on right now for Horizon 5 which will eventually get added to the game and have a series themed around it. That's certainly possible. So I want to know what you guys think in the comments section below. What are your predictions about what we're going to get in each month? Do you think we're going to get a Halloween themed update in October like I do? In November, are we going to get a yearly anniversary update? Will there be a holidays one in June, July or August? Will the first expansion have a themed update around it? Now, when it comes to decorations, we obviously have the stadium in Horizon 5, which is constantly getting reworked and updated with decorations for whatever updates happening. I'm sure in October, if we do get a Halloween related update, this stadium will be revamped to be spooky and cool. In September, if we get an Independence Day update, we might have, you know, a stadium full of, you know, celebrations and sort of parades and stuff like that. In November, if we get a yearly anniversary, it might be very, again, it might be very celebratory. It might be fireworks all over the place in the stadium and stuff like that. So it's quite exciting to see what we could be getting in the future when it comes to, you know, update themes and stuff like that. There's a lot of possibilities. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. I'm certainly intrigued. You guys know what I think now. And to anyone who's not very clued up on any of this, you know, series theme stuff, hopefully you now have a bit of idea of what we could be getting in the future. We'll wait and see. Leave a like if you enjoyed everyone, subscribe if you haven't already for more Horizon 5 content, and I'll see you all later.